out here today doing some digging. I got a 99 signal here. First hole of the day, just about. It's a gun. That is crazy. I think it's a toy gun. Pretty sure. I have no idea how old it could be. Let's get a close up of it. That's funny. I thought it was going to be a beer can. Should up like a 99. Awesome. Put that in the pouch. Maybe we'll find some bullets for it. I cleaned up the gun a little bit. It's a Crossman Frontier Model 36 single action BB gun. It's from the 70s. That's funny. No telling how it got there. I was about 10 feet from the main road, so somebody could have threw it out the window. <laughs> I just got a killer signal, and I think it's a silver spoon or a spoon. I'm gonna let y'all hear it. It's on top of the ground, sticking out. <laughs> That's what it sounded like. Wow. Oh, it is a spoon. It's on top of the ground. It's not silver. It's plated. <laughs> oh well. I thought it was silver. I think I just found an old house site. Out here in the woods. That's oh, a tiny old place. <laughs> Not much of a house. Wow. Look at that old chimney. That's cool. Let's explore inside of it. Let's see if there's anything in there. Maybe some relics. Oh, it stinks. There's a buzzard in there. I don't know if you can see it. It's under the little table. Oh, two legs. Oh, there it is. See it? Come here, boy. Oh, girl, I guess you could say. I've been using the Ace 250, and I just got an iron signal here, but I dug it anyway. It's a button. It's like a guy on there. I don't know. That's pretty cool. Let's see what it shows up like now. Right at nickel. <laughs> That's funny. It was down about six to eight inches. The Ace 250 has a barrel in there. That's got to be old. I'll take it. Found with the Ace 250, that just shows you, you don't need a expensive machine to find relics. Just gotta swing over it. I just found a wheat penny with the Ace 250. It's 1918. D, D mint mark. It just blew my ears out. I knew it was something good. Here's what it sounded like. Just locking right on. Right at Penny. I'm at a different place now, and I just dug a brass buckle. Get a pretty good signal. Down about two inches. Let me show you all the house site. It's really old. Not sure how long it was lived in. Here's some of the ruins. The steps look like they've been redone. There's the chimney ruins. Pretty sweet. I love finding places like this. Out in the woods. Not many people have dug them. Also found a little button with a star on it. Maybe World War I. Possible um, overall button. There it is. Has a little star on it. Go dig some more. I just found this tag. It says R.H.P. and F Company 289. It's made of brass. It's a cool little find. Not sure how old it is, but I'll take it. Here's my finds for today. Had a pretty good hunt. I found a Crossman 
Frontier Model 36 single action BB revolver. It was CO2 powered. Produced from 1970 to 1975. That's neat. Right beside the road. About 10 feet from it. No idea how it got there. It's missing the wood grips. And the trigger broke off. and I guess the CO2 cartridge would have went in there. It's a replica of an 1873 Colt single action revolver. That's what I thought it was when I dug it up. I thought it was an old revolver. I'm like, oh man. And I was like, nah, it's probably a toy gun. It turns out it's a real gun. This BB gun. Before my time, I uh, found some normal house side items, buckles, I like this one the best, solid brass, that right there is heavy duty, they don't make stuff like that anymore, I got a makeup compact, I opened it up to see if there was any coins in there, fortunately there wasn't, um, this little tag, I'm not sure how old it is, it says R.H.P and F, dot co which is probably company 289 this right here is probably off a of colonial belt slide I found him before at old 1700 spots little button it could be World War one or some type of overall button or even a Texas button I don't know I found them before I don't think they're that old found a couple spoons that little jar that's neat figured I'd keep it uh, another buckle here's my ace 250 finds I found a 1918d wheat penny a lighter have no idea what this thing is it's brass this could be some type of buckle <laughs> blew my ears out on that ace 250 good repeatable signal and I found this cool little bear button a little grizzly on there I guess missing the back no idea how old that is I have to look it up so I hope y'all enjoyed it thanks for watching good luck and happy hunting